Hey everyone, happy Monday. Um, I wanted to make a quick video because I'm making like an embarrassingly easy dinner tonight and I just wanted to show you guys how easy it is to put together a healthy meal. So my husband and I are on what we're calling a grocery diet. We're trying not to spend so much on groceries. Groceries are like shoe shopping for me. I can spend hours in a grocery store. I just love food. So, and I could spend a lot of money in a grocery store. So. I've been trying to make meals out of what we already have on hand at home. So tonight I'm going to make a Southwest quinoa salad. So it's really easy, really quick. So when I got home from work, I just put on a cup of red quinoa on the stove. Um, just one cup quinoa, two cups water, boiled it, um, and then lowered it to simmer for about like 20, 25 minutes until it's nice and fluffy. So I'm going to add that to my bowl and I let it cool off a little bit since I want this to be like more of a salad. Um, okay, so we have the quinoa. Next, I'm gonna add a can of black beans that I rinsed. Um, I also get low sodium black beans just because sometimes they put like a lot of stuff in them. This is just plain black beans. So I'm gonna add that. Okay, this is stuff like I already had on hand at home. Um, my husband and I also really love the bell peppers at Target. They sell them in a really big bag. They're like the mini sweet bell peppers. They're really good to snack on. They're really good to add to salads. So I'm going to add some of that into here. Oh, I forgot my kale. I love kale and the kale I have is about to go bad. So I'm going to add that to the salad too. Add that. And then pour, oh. And then for my dressing, I have this fresh salsa, also Target, I love Target. Um, I'm just gonna add about hmm, like a quarter to a third of a cup of salsa, depending on how saucy you guys want it. Um, just depend one, maybe a little more. I love salsa. And then we're just gonna mix this all together. And this also will give it like a nice Southwestern feel. I also have a creamy cilantro dressing, which would be really good. I just wanted a lighter dressing for this one. Um, I also wanna to top it with avocado, so that will be really good. And since salsas usually have salt, spices, um, using salsa kinda of like, you don't need to spice your food, it kinda of already takes on the spice of the salsa. So super convenient, super easy. You go. You could top with cilantro if you'd like. Um, for me, the salsa is more than enough. And there you go. You have a fiber, veggie, and protein packed meal. There's fiber in the beans and the quinoa. And then quinoa is also a complete protein, which means it has all the essential amino acids we need. Um, so it's a fun way to get protein. I like using the red quinoa just because I like colors. And you have kale and peppers for your vegetables and tomatoes in the salsa, of course. So um, I hope this shows that you can kind of use whatever you have on hand. I always try to keep like cans of beans on hand, quinoa, rice, things like that, so that I can always whip together something healthy and fast because we're all about fast nowadays. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and try the recipe soon. Bye.